Back in December of 1979, I had published an article in uh, Railroad Model Craftsman about the construction of a rotary dumper. Uh, I had seen an ad in the Railway Age magazine back in the 70s, and uh, this rotary dumper looked like it was easily modeled and made to work in HO, and I've been able to do that. So this dumper has been working for over three decades now, and uh, now I use JMRI to control it. So I'll show you how that's done. But first I want to just show you uh, the dumper in operation. I have the dumper controlled now by a, uh, a lens decoder with back EMF and I have a flat speed table programmed in so going up or down whether it's loaded or unloaded it's like cruise control it works very well much easier than using diodes and resistors under DC. And since the dumper is controlled by that locomotive decoder it can be con controlled by JMRI as well. And I was going to put a couple of switches over here on the fascia of the layout and control it. And then I thought, wait, I've got a control panel here on the tablet that can do this. And so here, I'll tilt this uh, up. This is a 10 inch tablet and it's showing you the um, Quaker Junction panel here. And what I've got down at the bottom of the panel are a couple of switches. And those switches control the rotary dumper. So Touching this switch here, shuts off the dumper, basically shutting down the locomotive, turning out uh, functions two and three, which are blinking lights and the headlight. And so when I turn it on, we'll get lights blinking on the dumper, and I'll show you that in a moment. And then to run it up, you just hit the, hit the up button, and the dumper starts up. Locomotive's in forward. Hit the switch the other way, and the locomotive or the dumper goes back in reverse and goes back down to the lower position. Of course I have lower and upper limit switches on the dumper to, to limit the travel. So when I turn the locomotive on or turn the decoder on, I've got the flashing lights on either side of the dumper to you know warn the operators in the area that the dumper's alive and in the back I don't know if you can see but there's a, a headlight it's come on it's in the lower position when uh, we go to turn it to the upper position the headlight goes to the opposite direction so you can kind of see that so we'll move a car up into position here and do another uh, operation of the dumper Cars in position. Start the dumper up. So there's lots of things you can do with uh, JMRI and the Panel Pro edit and editors. Uh, use your imagination. <laughs>